How to assign Google Form in Google Classroom. Well, that's what I'm going to show you guys in a super quick and easy tutorial. So if this video helped you out, please let me know in the comments or leave a like. So I actually know that this video helped you out. So obviously for this tutorial, we need um, uh, a Google Form as well as your Google Classroom, of course. So these are uh, the two websites we, which we need. Now, for the sake of this tutorial, I just created a really easy, um, uh, quick form, as you can see, just uh, very basic. Now, there's a couple settings which we can go over, and that is um, if you go to, for example, if you go to responses, uh, collect email addresses, you can, for example, automatically uh, collect email addresses, um, stuff like that. So here are a couple of settings which you could go over, uh, for example, make it a quiz and stuff like that. But once you're happy with your form, what we can do is simply go to Google Classroom and go to our class work. And here we can obviously create a new assignment. So we need to click on this. But here I'm going to give this a title. So I uh, put this as the title. Now you can also add a description and do all of that. For example, here to all students or select specific students, the amount of points, the due date, the topic, everything. This is more up to you. But in order to actually add a uh, Google form to your assignment is by simply clicking on the drive icon here for the attach section, because every single um, a uh, form is also saved in your Google Drive. So since you are, uh, since you have the form created with the same email address as you have for your uh, classroom, you can. This is all connected. So if I click on the form, then click on Add, we can now see that the form has been added. And I'm simply going to click on Assign. Uh, we can also schedule it or whatever. But I'm going to click on Assign and. We can now see the assignment over here and here we can see fill in this short form. If people click on this, they can now fill in the form. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how to assign Google form in Google Classroom.